I have something amazing in store for you. It is currently 1 a.m. I have been staying up all night, all night on Chinese Da Vinci Resolve, and I found some gold. First thing I'm going to go over is the contact sheet node. I will be putting the download in the description. It's absolutely game changing, especially if you're remaking edits. There's a lot of one framers happening and I want to efficiently copy over these effects. How am I going to do that? This is with the contact sheet node. You cut out the parts that you want to copy. It doesn't really matter. Compound clip it, go into fusion and then add the contact sheet node. Give it a second and there you go. So now the each frame of the video is laid out in grid form sequentially. So this is frame one, frame two, frame three, frame four, frame five, and so on. I can get my second media in there. I could get my media in there, use the switch node, and make framers for each frame. So I can change the saturation on this one, connect this, turn the saturation down and contrast, connect that. Let's make a third one. Let me reference the contact sheet. He made it red on that, like a little darker with scan lines. One of those, put that in the switch node, right? And using the switch node, I can just keyframe one, two, and three. And it's really easy and simple to just remake frames like that. So I recommend that method. If you don't have the switch node, you can do the same thing with the dissolve node, or you can use the merge and just change the blend between each frame. So it'd be like this one and this one. You can change the blend. And once the blend is zero, then it's not affected. So yeah, that's a quick overview of the channel sheet node. I really hope AMV users start using this in their day-to-day -day basis when they're remaking edits because it's super helpful. Anyway, that's it for today.